Hello, everyone, and welcome back. As always, I'm your girl, Candy Washington. And before we dive in, be sure to like, subscribe, share, and join our newsletter down below. So with that, let's dive right on in. So spotted. As we all know, this weekend was, you know, it's Monday. Happy Monday. And this weekend was the first weekend of Coachella. I personally did no Coachella. Like, no, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good, boo-boo. But as we know, Ariana was out at Coachella with uh, Sheena and Dana and her new boy, Daniel Way, and all of this, that, and the third. But then we have Tom Sandoval out here in the streets in West Hollywood spotted with Billy Lee of all people. Now we all know that Billy Lee, she was featured on, I believe it was season eight, maybe season seven, season eight, maybe of, of Vanderpump Rules. She basically was in and out. <laughs> um, she got in a lot of fights with Lala and other people. But let's dive into the situation with her switching sides, apparently. Let's dive in as Kristen Doty also weighs in. And I'm going to give my thoughts on why I think Billy Lee was first supposedly supporting Ariana and now is hanging out with Tom Sandoval. Also, don't forget, Tom Sandoval was supposed to, allegedly, rumor had it, was supposed to be joining Raquel at the wellness retreat that she went to that her PR people called a mental health facility. But it turns out he did not join her this weekend. He went to a conference and he was out in West Hollywood. He was at TomTom Tom and he's hanging out with Billy Lee. But let's dive right on in. So this scoop is from Reality Blurb. Kristen Doty spoke out against Billy Lee after seeing that the former Vanderpump Rules cast member had stepped out with Tom Sandoval in Los Angeles. After Billy and Sandoval attended an event together on Friday, Kristen took to Instagram where she called out her ex-co-star for spending time with Sandoval after, after being by Ariana Maddox's side after she learned Sandoval had been cheating on her for months with friend Raquel. In photos shared by Page Six on April 16th, that's what's on the screen, Sandoval was seen walking in an all-black ensemble with white sneakers with Billy, who wore a baby blue dress with white sneakers and a gray hoodie. All right. According to the report, the duo was joined by a group of friends in the West Hollywood neighborhood of L.A., where Sir Restaurant and TomTom Tom are located. I heard they were at TomTom. Tom. But despite Billy's potential allegiance with Sandoval, who has lost a ton of friends and fans in the light of his affair with Raquel, she seemed to be on Team Ariana around the same time. After Ariana shared a photo from, from Coachella where she flaunted what appeared to be a new romance with Daniel Way, Billy weighed in with a supportive comment. Quote, it's your happiness shining through for me, Billy wrote, as seen in a screenshot shared by Queens of Bravo on Instagram on April 16th. That's what's also on the screen, you guys. All right. As a number of Pump Rules fans attempted to figure out if Billy was Team Sandoval or Team Ariana, Kristen spoke out about the situation, seemingly calling Billy out for playing both sides of the situation. As she cried at Ariana's house days after Ari found out, dot, 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 shake my head, Kristen wrote. Shout out to cc.lovesyou and also um, Queens of Bravo for their Instagram post. Okay, it's when to shout them out. Let's keep going. While Sandoval has continued to be spotted with Raquel in early weeks since their affair was uncovered, she checked into a mental health facility, a.k.a. a wellness retreat center, earlier this month. Raquel had decided before the relationship between her and Sandoval was discovered that she would enter a voluntary facility for mental health counseling. An insider told Entertainment Tonight, if I believe that, I'm, ugh, I'm not sure. I think that her parents and her family wanted her to seek some help. I don't know what kind of help you get for, I don't, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What's the diagnosis, I guess. I guess that's my question. Maybe that's why she's getting counseling at the wellness spa to figure out what's really wrong with her. I don't know. I just think it's her personality. Is there treatment for that? I don't know. Now, it's one thing if they said she's getting treatment to deal with, you know, all of the backlash. Okay, I get that, you know. But I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Put it down below. Let's keep going. Okay, now let me dive into what I think is actually going on here. 
I, I don't think that Billy, I don't think she is playing the fence when it comes to Ariana versus Tom Sandoval. I think she's team Ariana. I think she likes Ariana. Also, don't forget she dated, I don't know how seriously or casually, Ariana's brother, Jeremy. They had a thing. So clearly she knows Ariana. She's been with the family. She dated his brother, however briefly or seriously, I'm not sure, but they did date. This is where I think Billy is team Sandoval. I think that Billy is still a little pissed, still feels very slighted about the way she was portrayed, about the way she was treated when she was on the show. You know, Katie wasn't very nice to her. Lala was not very nice to her. Uh, I don't know if Kristen Doty was still on the show then. I don't know. I, I don't think so. I think maybe I'm not sure if Kristen was on the show still then or not. I'm thinking no. I'm not 100% sure. I can't remember. But you know, Katie had the girls' night, didn't tag Billy, didn't invite Billy. And Billy's like, you know, as we know, Billy is a trans woman. And so she's like, Did you not invite me because you don't consider me like one of the girls? You know, obviously, I don't think that Katie was being transphobic or anything like that. But I think that Katie and Lala and the girls made it a much bigger issue than it needed to have been. They should have just said, I'm so sorry. That's not why I didn't invite you. However, I understand how you feel that way. And I am so sorry. You know, fine. You can beef with somebody, whatever. But like, you know, things with like identity and sexuality and race and all of that, that trumps any of this petty storyline BS these people are trying to do. Like if it were me and I just didn't want Kate and I didn't want Billy to come for whatever reason. But if Billy came to me and was just like, well, you know, I'm a trans woman and you're having girls night. I'm trying to you know, be a part of the girls and you don't tag me and you don't invite me, that makes me feel left out. And it makes me feel like you don't really see me as a woman. Then I would be like, I'm so sorry. That was not my intention. So I think that, and I believe Billy and Lala had issues. Billy was like, Lala, you're not better than me. Like all of this stuff. And as we all know, Tom Sandoval hates the girls you know Tom just like Ariana said a couple episodes ago I'm not doing this I'm not doing Tom versus the girls he's been like that to Katie he's been like that to Lala he's been like that to Kristen he's been like that to Stassi you know the list goes on and on and on and on and on so I do think that Billy probably feels a little bit of allegiance to Tom because as we know Tom likes to be on whosoever side the girls are against so I think there's a little bit of allegiance there. So I'm I'm not going to go too hard on Billy on this one. I've seen mixed reviews on social media. Some people are like, we never trusted her. This is why she's off the show. I can't believe you're doing this. But I don't know. I don't, I don't know where I land with that. That's actually kind of where I land with it. I think that Billy's probably really cool with Ariana. She dated her brother. She understands the situation. She wants to support her. But then I also think she probably feels like, well, Sandoval had my back when the other girls were being, quote, mean to me or whatever the case may be. So, you know what? Stassi still was on the show because Billy did Stassi's podcast. Okay, it's all coming back to me now. It's all coming back to me now. That's right. Okay. So, so yeah, I think that. I, I think that's where I kind of think Billy's landing. But as always, I want to know what you guys think. Do you think Billy's being two-faced? You know, crying with Ariana one minute and the next doing, you know, uh, calling the paparazzi and doing a TMZ photo op with, you know, um, Tom in West Hollywood at Tom Tom. I don't know. Did you guys like her on the show? Did you not like her on the show? What do you guys think? Put it down below as always. But before you do that, you know what to do. Go ahead and like, subscribe, and share, and join our newsletter. With that, you guys, I'll talk to you later. Bye.